Why, hello there, it's Mr. McFlanagan, your old buddy, your old pal, your old chum, and we playing some domination. You know, domination, ground war, can you feel it, can you feel the energy? And I'm using this MP7 with a suppressor and stock, and you might be thinking to yourself, why in the hell would you use stock on the MP7? Well, basically because you can strafe and cut left and right like crazy, and oh my god, I got blown the hell up. But yeah, if you put stock on an SMG, you can cut like crazy. I mean, you can go left, right, super fast when you ADS. And the MP7, it already has pretty fast quick draw, and the reload speed is pretty quick. And look at this, one, two, three! Can he go all the way? Miss the C4 juke and jive, miss the knife? Oh my god! And then he gets the Black Ops 1 knife to the face. To the face! And there we go. Oh, he just keeps going. McFlanagan just keeps going. You can't stop him. And uh, look at this. I'm running the Hellstorm missile with, uh, what is it? The War Machine and UAV. I mean, that's pretty good. The War Machine sucks, but it's so fun to use. You know what I mean? The War Machine, that it's turbo time. Boom, 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 boom. It's fun to use. And look, I'm just still going off. And uh, this is a new series that I'm going to do. And it's basically... I'm going to do round one domination and then round two, but I'm not going to do them all together because I don't expect you people to sit down and watch a 10 to 12 minute video because that sucks. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do the first round completely all the way through and look at that hellstorm. That, that's the worst hellstorm ever, but I'm going to do the first round all the way through and then maybe a day or two later, maybe the next day, I'm going to do the second round. So you can see both rounds because domination is a silly crazy game type where you can do so good the first round and then just get beat to death the second round because people rage quit they leave you get better players in the lobby and then sometimes guys sit on their streaks like somebody may have gotten a swarm the first round but they wait to call it in till the second round so it's an interesting game type it's fun to watch so that's how i'm going to do it first round one video second round next video and uh this lobby i'm playing these guys are not too great I mean, right there I should have got both of them, though. But one thing about this lobby is the connection was really, really good, because I wasn't even playing for a gameplay. It just happened. I mean, that's probably the best time is when you're really not trying for a gameplay. You're just having fun. I mean, look at my streaks. I don't run the War Machine, War Machine unless I'm just trying to have fun. I was actually going for clips, because uh, I think I Am Too Strong is doing a, like a community montage where you can send him clips. So I've been trying to get some clips for his montage, because I'm a big fan of that dude, and it'd be cool to be in one of his montages but uh that's pretty much the skinny on the new series i'm gonna do i mean i think you guys will like it i got some crazy gameplays like yesterday and the day before I, I even got a gameplay on dig you guys remember dig the shitty map dig i actually got a crazy gameplay on that i mean i had a couple frenzy kills i mean of course i'm using this mp7 which is sick and then boom i get crushed by this see the trolley just crush me and uh, I always forget about that. I don't know why, because this, this is such a good place to watch B from. So, I mean, I get crushed all the time by that damn thing. But uh, I have been watching a lot of Advanced Warfare videos lately. I've been watching a lot of commentaries on what guys, uh, you know, what they think's good, what they think's bad. I know they got the No Exosuit playlist, which, you know, some guys are saying don't look a gift horse in the mouth. Like, you know, it can't be bad. If, if, if people want to play that list, it can't be bad. Where, I mean, I know I know it's good to have the choice between no exosuit and exosuit, but it's like, there's all these people that play, and you want them all in the same area. Like, for instance, Hardcore and Core takes so many of the people and splits them where they never ever play each other. And I feel like with the non-exosuit playlist, it's going to do the same thing. It's going to take the community and, like, divide it in half. I mean, maybe. It could even be so, such a thing where nobody plays the non-exosuit playlist because the, the, the exosuit's so good. And look at these snipers, man. They just 5-7 the shit out of me. And look, but look, I'm back. You like using that secondary? Oh, I don't even care that I wasted that Hell, Hellstorm missile. I just wanted to kill that sniper. And look at this dude. What the hell is he doing? But I mean, I guess we're just going to have to wait and see what that playlist does. We'll have to see if it does divide the community. I mean, I, I don't know. I know I have no problem with the exosuits. I think it looks fun. I'm, I'm honestly kind of bored right now with first-person shooters. And maybe it'll be something that will get me back in and get me focused. And, I mean, I'm, I'm more than happy to step up to the plate and test my skills. I think Titanfall was a good game for that. You know, it's something that was kind of hard to figure out. A lot of guys were noobs. 
And, and it's fun, you know? Figuring out a new game and figuring out new skills is really fun. That's the fun part of the game, going from somebody who sucks to somebody that's a pretty decent player. I mean, I've talked to Thunder about this, The Legend of Thunder. I told him, I said, it isn't the funnest part of the game is just like that two-week when it comes out and you're learning all the new setups and guns and all that. I mean, that's where the fun is in gaming for me. But I hope you enjoyed this video, and stick around, because I'll have part two up in the next couple days. And look at this beast right here with the target finder. Oh my god! This game's been out for two years, and you're still using a target finder? Oh my god! You're an idiot. But uh, I'll see you on the next one, guys. Thanks for watching.